All right, everyone. So the 49ers have been dealing with some serious, serious injury issues, and they had to make a big decision because of it. So this is an article from ESPN titled 49ers Saints canceled joint practices amid San Francisco injuries. With injuries mounting, the San Francisco 49ers have made a significant adjustment to their preseason schedule, announcing Sunday that they've canceled their planned joint practices with the New Orleans Saints. The 49ers and Saints have mutually agreed to cancel the joint practices that were scheduled in Irvine on Thursday, August 15th, and Friday, August 16th, the Niners said in a statement. Those joint sessions have been slated to take place in Irvine, California, where the Saints have been training before the teams were set to play a preseason game next Sunday at the Niners' Levi's Stadium in Santa Clara. A source told ESPN that the driving force behind the decision was the numerous injuries that have plagued the 49ers during camp. A variety of soft tissue ailments have prevented multiple players from participating in practice for more than a week. When the Niners par- practiced Thursday, a whopping 23 players did not take part for various reasons. An injury hit again in their preseason op- opener against the Tennessee Titans on Saturday night, with cornerback Ambry Thomas suffering a broken right hand that is expected to keep him out for an extended period. All right, so they had to cancel joint practice after all these injuries they're facing and this is a big deal now certainly they can get healthy by the time the season's here and you know we'll see if the trade with Ayuk ever gets done if it does get done that's going to be a big deal but i will say that you know this is a major year for brock purdy because brock purdy has has supporters but he also has this large group of detractors who say he can't elevate his teammates that he is only the product of a good team And with all these injuries, this may be something that carries into the season. He's going to have to be the driving force on this team if Christian McCaffrey misses time or if Christian McCaffrey isn't 110%. He has to, right? So we'll see if he's able to do it. But you got to feel for the 49ers. I mean, they really missed a big, big opportunity last season. Last season, they had every chance to win that Super Bowl. In the Super Bowl, they had a chance to win the game. And they just blew it. I mean, they're up 10. Patrick Mahomes throws an interception. You have the ball in the second half. You got to make plays to finish out that game. And they were certainly unable to do it. So thank you all for watching. And we will see you next time.